hot cars can become a death trap for children left inside. Two infants were found inside one just yesterday in South Nashville. Their parents were sighted. And as our Chris Conti found out, the problem actually happens more than you might think. It's a story all new at 630. We consider them the most precious of cargo. And yet every year in every state, they get left behind. You know, it makes you sick to your stomach to know that, that it's going to happen. Amber Ambreeson works for the organization KidsInCars.org based in Kansas City. And we need to keep talking about this. And we, we reached out to her today after two children were left alone inside a hot car in South Nashville last night. When a child's body temperature rises three to five times faster than an adult's. So it doesn't have to be a 95 degree day outside for a child to die from heat stroke. Last year, 25 children died after suffocating inside of hot cars. Most happened by accident. Most of the time, it is a loving, responsible, caring, educated parent who unknowingly left their child in the vehicle. In fact, many times they go to the daycare at the end of the day thinking, that they had dropped the baby off that morning. That is exactly what happened to Stephanie Gray in 2012. I thought Joel was safe. I thought I had dropped my son off at daycare. I thought that's where he was. She unknowingly left her son Joel inside her minivan. The temperature was 93 degrees. Joel was just five months old. I found my son in the car. Um, and my son was clearly um, I don't even know if struggling is the word. He was lifeless, and um, it's something that I'll never forget. It's um, This is something that can happen to anybody. To prevent another tragedy, Amber wants parents to leave small reminders in their back seats. Your employee badge, your laptop, something that you would have to use throughout your day in that back seat so you have to physically open the door and get back there to get it. Because one child dying inside a hot car is one too many. It happens to all different types of people and it could happen to you. Chris Conti, News Channel 5. Temperatures inside of a car can become deadly in just 10 minutes. For more tips and information, head to our website, newschannel5.com.